Welsh Festival. Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. Thanks so much for being here for week 12 in our 15-week festival, inspired by filmmaker Mark Cousins' 15-part documentary, The Story of Film and Odyssey, an in-depth look at the history of cinema from Mark's perspective. We're going to be premiering this week's episode at 2.15 a.m. Eastern, and sorry about that late hour, but it's actually due to content issues. Episode 12 looks at films from the 80s, and you know how salty and adult movies were getting to be at that time. Well, we have a number of lesser adult films from that era for you right now, all of them mentioned, though, in episode 12 of the series. We're going to begin with a coming-of-age story from Scotland in 1981, a movie called Gregory's Girl. No relation at all to Georgia Girl, not even close. In our film, Gregory is a boy of 16. He's tall, he's awkward, he's just about to stop admiring girls from afar and begin asking them for a date. He gets his chance when a beautiful girl named Dorothy earns a spot on his school's soccer team. So he sets out to win Dorothy's heart, but as usual, things don't go as planned. It's a movie that was written and directed by Bill Forsyth, whose background wouldn't necessarily make you think he'd be a master at telling sensitive stories like this one is. He was a big, sturdy Scottish boy, still a teenager when he got his first job in the film business. His first job required him to be strong enough to carry heavy pieces of studio equipment, and strong he was. Well, eventually he began making documentaries, and did that for several years, always though with his sights set on making a regular feature film, and he eventually did. It was a comedy called That Sinking Feeling, and was so well received in his native Scotland, he was able to raise the funds needed to make this movie Gregory's Girl. And once he made this film and a follow-up called Local Hero with Burt Lancaster in 1983, Bill Forsyth became Scotland's first internationally recognized filmmaker. And with that success, he was able to help build an infrastructure to increase film production in his country. So now we bring you this marvelous movie which brought such wide attention to both Bill Forsyth as a filmmaker and to Scotland as a contributor to world cinema. From 1981, here's Gregory's Girl. <laughs> 